As Built Modeler, Send 2, Modeling with Rhinoceros 3D. After this tutorial, you will be able to import macros for Rhino. Use Send 2 for modeling. In As Built Modeler, go to the Apps tab. Click the satellite icon and click Send 2. This icon opens Pharaoh's macro library in the knowledge base. You can download macro libraries on this site. There are numerous libraries available. Select Macros for Rhino. Click Download. Extract it. It contains a zip file with the macros plus a PDF with instructions for their use. This icon imports macros for your use in Descend 2. Navigate to your saved macro file. Select it, then click Open. In the list on the left are the macros ready to be imported. Import everything using the double arrows. Click OK. Note, when you import macros with the same name, Send2 compares them. If they are 100% the same, the macro isn't imported. If their content is different, Send2 prompts you to choose a new name. Connect AsBuilt Modeler to Rhino by dragging and dropping the satellite icon to Rhino. Use the Create Planes macro for modeling the walls. Click three points for each wall in the scan view. Press Shift to navigate. The planes appear in Rhino. Repeat the procedure for the other walls in the floor. Use Rhino tools for intersecting the planes. Let's create the beam and the column by extruding planes. First, create a plane running the appropriate macro. Then run Extrude SRF in Rhino. Select the plane. When asked for a distance, run the RH underscore HOR macro in Send2 and click two points on the edges of the column. Repeat the procedure for the horizontal beam. To place the windows in the wall, you need to define a construction plane. Click the Create Construction Plane macro. The command started in Rhino. Pick two points to define the plane in the third point for the direction. Now we can draw the rectangles for the windows. Click the Create Rectangles using Three Points macro. Click the points. To draw the stairs, activate this macro which draws a 3D polyline to Rhino. Click two points on the steps and press Enter. Again, click the macro button. Click two points on the steps and press Enter. Continue this until you complete all the steps.